You know, I want to talk about something that I see through the lens of an experienced divorce lawyer in an effort to have you think about something if you're thinking about getting married. Far too many times I see people going through divorce because they lose sight of the fact that they probably shouldn't make their spouse their number one priority, and they do. Many people lose sight of the fact that they need to make their own health their first priority, their physical health, their mental health, so they can be the best person in the relationship. The other thing that they lose sight of is their passions after they get married. They all of a sudden take all their energy and put it into the other person when it's not in their own best interest and they end up resenting the other person. So number one, you got to take care of your own health. Uh, I've seen a lot of people get married and then just explode in terms of weight and they get terribly out of shape. Uh, their mental health suffers. Sometimes they lose themselves in work and then both parties suffer. Nobody's happy and they end up splitting up where it didn't have to be that way. And again, number two, I see where people make the other person such the centerpiece of their life that they stop doing the things that bring them joy. And then when they're not getting back from their spouse, all that they think that they deserve, they get resentful. So don't lose sight of what your priorities really should be. You could still love and take care of the other person and be taken care of too in a, in a great marriage, but far too many times I see people lose their way. And once they're married, they stop doing the things that bring them joy. They stop following their passions and it's a mess. One thing that really expedites all these problems is when one person becomes extremely needy, okay? So uh, you get married and you can no longer do things that bring you joy because the other person needs you around all the time. Yikes. Just come on into my office. We'll talk about it because you're going to get divorced. It's an untenable situation that I don't want to see you go through. So set your priorities, stick with them, vet carefully. Make sure that you're not getting married to someone who is extremely needy or unstable to the point where it's going to throw you off course. All right? A prenup is always a good idea, too, in case you uh, find yourself in the unenviable position of being served with a divorce complaint. You can always modify the terms of a prenup by mutual agreement of the parties. But if you don't have one, you're stuck. And I don't want to see that happen. Share this with someone who needs to see it, who's dating a needy person. All right? Like, drop a comment, subscribe. Love to have you as part of the community. And keep your priorities straight. All right? It's only one life you get.